Regal with Brandon Lou and H.C. Loke here. And it's here they come. Lucky 13. Oh, oh this is quickness and awareness. Oh! oh. oh. Another one. Went oh. again. Oh, <laughs> what? Mind game. What do you like mind game? Oh, oh. No. Pump handle. Has him up. And now look at the fly, a senton. And now T.I.M. flipping over. Gets the... What, wait, what is this? Oh! No. Gabriel, somebody get this goofball off. No, no, we need oh, justice. Oh, no! With the championship. Yeah. Shooting. One, no. two, three. Oh, oh. No champions. And welcome to Catalyst Wrestling. We're here at the Catalyst Wrestling Studios in Sapphire 39, New York City, New York. And if I have to take a guess, I'll introduce you this time, buddy. And this is Brandon Liu. Now, if I had to take a guess, our, our friend here, Brandon, might be a little upset because his team, the Hot Boys International, lost the Catalyst Tag Team Championship last week and it seems that someone's still dealing with that. Are you not? Stocks are low, Dave. Stocks are low. Well, th there's no shame in it. There's no shame in being beat by a master. And to infinity in the pot, an amazing team. And, well, Hot Boys International do have a lot of experience with the Ugly Ducklings. This might have thrown them for a loop. So there's nothing to be ashamed of, buddy. No. There's no reason there's to There's a legacy of hotness that maintains and Catalyst Wrestling, and, and, and we will, it will, it will carry us forth. But without the goal. What are we looking forward to tonight? 
we are looking forward to Myron Reed's debut right here at Catalyst as he goes against the freestyle champion, none other than Ghost Shadow. We're going to get to that right here when we come back to Catalyst Wrestling. Experience the peak of New York nightlife at any of Sapphire's three locations in the heart of New York City. World-class food, world-class bartenders, and world-class entertainment and atmosphere, Sapphire New York will leave you wanting more. Find out on how you can have an elite experience at nysapphire.com. Catalyst Wrestling. I'm here with the one and only Ghost Shadow. Now, tonight, we have a lot of things to discuss. Oh, well, uh, Ghost ah. Shadow's kind of important these days. Uh, why are you talking to me? Well, I, when it comes to Catalyst Wrestling, I think I'm one of the top interviewers for people. Excuse me, didn't you just hear this man right here? Well, I didn't you just hear him? No, I might as well take a hike. I, thank you. Anyway, like this man here, the freestyle champion for two years. This man doesn't need an introduction. Do you? I don't think so. So you know what, something? Let me introduce myself, first of all. The man that no one, everyone loves, Noel. I'm gonna be with this man from now on here in Catalyst Wrestling. And first on the agenda is Myron Reed. You may be hot fire wherever you go, but guess what? Those people don't have the courage to book this man. This man right here. He's gonna show you a wrestling lesson you've never seen before. Woo! That's right. The young goat's in the building, man. You already know what's up. Ghost Shadow, young goat. The old generation versus the new generation. I've watched you, I know, and we're similar. It's like, I feel like, I bet you feel like it's like watching your younger self 10, 20 years in, in advance, in the future. I got a whole generation on my back. This is no longer 2005 or 2004. You are not the leader of the Northeast no more. I'm in your town now. I'm ready to prove myself. Prove that the next generation is strong and we got people backing it like myself. So tonight, with freestyle chain on it, with the freestyle chain on the line and all that, the young goat's gonna prove it again. He's gonna come up big. Welcome back to Catalyst Wrestling. Now, when we take a look at Ghost Shadow, the freestyle champion right here at Catalyst, I've gotta say, that is a man who has never been pinned. He has never submitted. And his only loss was by choice via DQ against Steve Gifty, who is another champion and the Sapphire Television Champion. So when we look at Myron Reed, he's got a lot to take on here. Yes, he is an accomplished wrestler. He has won gold all around this industry and multiple other promotions. But who's going to come out on top, Raymond? I think you make uh, an amazing point when you talk about both of these gentlemen. But there's one thing you haven't considered. I'm here that Ghost Shadow has brought with him some counsel and maybe some extra foresight, so, so, some extra knowledge from whoever his guidance is going to be. That might be the edge that we see going forward. Oh, uh, hang on, we got urgent news, urgent news. Kobe Carino and Darius Carter, uh, they're getting into a conversation. We, we have to go right now. We have to take you to that right now. Here's my title. Who do you think you are? And there's the rag to clean. Make it look good because it's coming back with me tonight. <laughs> if you want rebellion, if you want violence, if you want action, if you want wrestling, this is the DVD you need. Buy the uncensored, unfiltered, unhinged event that will make you feel something you haven't felt in a long time. The only show to step into the world of comedy. The show that brought homicide back to Brooklyn. This is New York City. This is Skankfest. This is Catalyst Wrestling. Skankfest 2019, available July 7th on DVD. And there's no bigger moment right now 
than the freestyle championship. If he could dethrone someone who has been the champion for so long, how impressive would that be? I mean, forget to do Well calling the kettle black here early in the contest. Two years with that title. Two years and iron grasp. Many men have tried. All have failed in the face of Ghost Shadow here. Now you put you pointed this out earlier that he's had the he's had the title for two years. But here's the real thing, he's never been pinned. So if Myron Reed, Reed pins him, the first man to pin Ghost Shadow here at Catalyst Wrestling, that almost is a bigger pin in his cap. It's all about the championship, but to your point, you're right. Both would be impressive feats in their own right, but to do both at once, that's a tall task to ask of Myron Reed in his Catalyst Wrestling debut here. But Loke, you've scouted this young man, and you know that if anybody's up to the task, it's Myron Reed. Myron Reed is a well-traveled young man. He's not that old, but he's been all over this country, all over the world, doing what he does, doing what he's gonna do tonight in that ring for the fans of Catalyst Wrestling. Trying to add to that gold resume. Reed, who's never been shy about his place in professional wrestling, wanting to seize the top. No shadow. Big leg sweep. We've seen this before, manipulating limbs. I mean, Go Shadow's match with Braden Lee, we saw that he really worked the leg for a long time in that match. Oh, backslide. And now, a little nod of respect there from Byron Reed. Oh! oh. Big scissor kick to the back. Got line. up above the top rope before he came down. The elevation, looking to elevate once again. Oh, through the middle rope into the Catalyst Wrestling Faithful here. That's what you get with the price of your admission. Now it's I, a front he's row not done. seat. He's not done. Here he goes again. Now up oh. over the top. Oh! <laughs> this is the most trouble we've seen Ghost Shadow in, and it's early in the match. And Ghost Shadow still has yet to move, but wisely read. Needs to capitalize because he's got to win it in him the on ring. The outside. Can't beat him on the outside. Getting him back in the ring is Reed. Huge opportunity here. And Reed measuring Ghost Shadow. Up and over the outside, right back in. Ghost Shadow not falling for that. Dodge. Oh, it's a Curry. This is the first time I, I feel like I've seen Go Shadow put off balance here. I mean, knowing Go Shadow, he's probably playing possum. You're gonna see something from him in a minute. That's impossible to play possum. Someone like Myron Reed here. Especially when he catches the boot in the temple. Whoa! Flying head scissors there. Put just like that back in the game. Shotgun drop hit. Double barrel into the chest. Forearm sweeping the leg. Oh, those double knees. Number one, two. No hook in the leg there, though. So many tools in the arsenal. 
of Ghost Shadow, that mad scientist bomb, that mad scientist lock. Either way, he can beat you with, with impact, he can beat you with submission skills. Just toss him. Just toss him. Ghost Shadow stalking. Oh, forearm. Goes in the gap quickly. Hanging him up on that middle rope. Oh, right in the back of the head. Now hung up is Reed as Ghost Shadow. Getting to that. Oh! <laughs> Somersault leg drop. Almost decapitating Reed. Cover made, one, two, three. Go Shadow victorious here, quick and sudden. And the two year reign continues. Are your loans becoming too much of a monster for you to handle? Let Fresh Start Advancement help you get in the ring and take on any challengers, including financial coaching, debt negotiation, loan modifications, and more. Call FSA now at 201-870-0473 or go online to freshstartadvancement.com. Fresh Start Advancement. They give you the ability to fight for your dreams as well as your family. So get it right and start fresh with Fresh Start Advancement. Myron Reed, uh, just, I, he, he's been knocked out. He's never been knocked out, and we're just talking to Catalyst Medical Facilities, and they're telling us that, they're telling us that there might be some foul play in here. That, that, that This is not, I'm like, I hate to suggest that this has happened to Ghost Shadow, or that he's doing something different, but there, there's really no explanation. It seems that he's used a loaded boot Against. Can you listen to yourself? Can you, yeah. Can you listen to yourself? You sound ridiculous. We're talking about Ghost Shadow. We're talking about a man who we advertise as a as a hybrid fighter. A man who is a master of mixed martial arts and aerial maneuvers and and and, and, and you will Greco Roman style tear you to pieces to take you down. And and you're saying that he, he he used a loaded boot. Is that what you're saying? That's what medical physician. Carl K. Fabian is saying, yeah! yeah the well, one. not only that, he's also suggesting that as soon as Myron Reed is cleared to wrestle again, which will be soon, he should get an automatic shot at the Freestyle Championship just because of the foul play here. And everything you just said, everything you just said about Go Shadow, let's not forget, Myron Reed is capable of all that too. Hence why this is a freestyle division. Hey, you may be right, you may be wrong. All I know is right now is Ghost Shadow is victorious, and I know that Ghost Shadow has some counsel, and it seems to be working out really nice for me. All right, so we're gonna move from the Freestyle Championship division to the Catalyst Wrestling Championship, because as we saw earlier in the show, Kobe Carino and Darius Carter got into a confrontation, but that's all going to change because next week we're going to get the resolution to this as we have, for the first time ever, Kobe Carino, the Catalyst Wrestling Champion, takes on the challenger, Darius Carter, the All-Father. We're going to see that next week, but before we do that, let's end with some comments from our champion, Kobe Carino. Darius Carter by any means necessary type of guy. And a part of me respects a type of guy like that. But that type of man is not the man that, you, that can put the company on his back and be a champion. Darius Carter, you might have beaten a good portion of Catalyst Wrestling's roster, but I beat the best of them. And I beat the best of the, the people that aren't even on our roster. So you think that after two years, that Darius Carter is going to be the one that prizes this title for my hands? 
They say that iron sharpens iron. Well, I'm steel, and I'm coming for your throat, Darius. <laughs>